in the humble viewer grace to stream along with crazy of grizzled bees along came this song from when the red bear fought a silver tongue devil his army of bullshit at his word did they teddy bear. When he was made, they found something wrong with him and threw him away like a piece of rubbish into an old dark storeroom. Then, from outer space, a spotty man brought him to life with his cosmic dust. 
he took him to a magic cloud where Mother Nature gave him special powers. That bear became Super Ted. We out here. Let's get that microphone up in the mix. We are here. I think. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, we are. We are here, fam. We are here, fam. Wait a second. We fucking... We are here. Uh, yeah. Line. Get in there. Cheers. Mm. Time for spooky bollocks. In it. Uh, the vibes be cosy. Well, we'll see about that. Hello, welcome to this nightmare, I'm sure it's going to be. Watch me have a fucking re moment now and it's not saved my fucking progress or something ridiculous like that. Should be fine. You are correct, it probably would be my entrance. At some point it'll show you the screen, you know the score. Just amazed it's uh, doing it in a game like this. There we go. Right, so we're on day three. Did you get a chance to catch up on anything or at least watch the trailer? Who knows? Anyway, here we are in whatever this town is. Now, it does get a bit glitchy, we've noticed. You hear the sound skipping. I'm, I'm losing frames somehow in a point-and-click game. But it only seems to happen in this tavern. Stanley, why is your Good pub morning. broken? Stanley? Ah, Miss Bateman. Mr. Shoulder left a note for you. Thank you, Stanley. This t-shirt. Why did I fucking buy an oversized t-shirt and then get it in a big size anyway? What an idiot. <laughs> Miss Bateman, meet, my, uh, meet me at my home as soon as you read this. There is no time to waste. Leonard. Oh, there were a key with it too. Hmm. Sadly not. Well, you've got no idea what's going on. Haunting imagery. I saw a spoilery kind of, uh, of imagery Father. earlier. Father Roach, what is the meaning of this? There's no for you here, lass. Clear off. I beg you, Miss Bateman. Oh, they know I'm about to get fucked in fucked here, Dick Mr. Boyd. Father. Something like that. Here to wish Miss Bateman good luck for her excavation, gentlemen. Am I heck? Mr. Kemp, you know. An no change there then, yeah, fair one. Strongly supported by Lord Panswick, no less. I wish you well with your findings, Miss Bateman. May the Lord strengthen you and guard you from the evil. So, as far as I can tell, I think we're about to uh, raise some ancient evil pagan god. We established yesterday that we have to give our blood willfully to make this happen because our dad was here some 25 years ago and fucked some shit up. But. I must make haste to Mr. Shoulders. Which, well, that's this way. Right, so I'm only allowed to go one particular direction. I don't want to fast travel it. Just in case we see anyone else. Could be pretty on and off, but I'm. Uh, if I go, I'm coming back. All right, cool. That is good to know. I think it is this way. I must make haste. It is not this way. Why is the crow dead? It's dead. The poor thing is beyond help. This crow has been here for a while. Why this is the crow dead? This is where I. That's that's not a fucking good omen, is it? Ah! Is he gonna leg it? He's scared Douglas? of me. What's why is everyone seems to know something that I don't? Douglas dropped his toy sword. It's just a toy. It's no use to me. Have a quick sit on the old bench. Mm. 
you know, every now and then we get a chibi for sitting on the bench. Oh shit, last time we were here, um, we fixed a little girl's fiddle. She played some fiddle standing atop this, and then we passed the fuck out. We still don't know what that's about. Devil. What a big cock. Hmm. Right, I'm not sure how much of this game is left. Oh, hang on, where are the chickens? Oh god, have, we, have they taken the chickens for sacrificing? I, I said that really weird. What's this? It's, it's, What's this? It's, set, it's set upon the moors, though what moors I couldn't tell you. And I forget where we are. A box. It's locked. Probably need that key then. I assume the key was to get into Mandem's house, but... Oh, what are you doing, woman? Mr. Shoulder, I got your note. Explain yourself. Confess. He's not going to answer again, is he? He never answers that fucking door. Look, there's the fiddle. See, I picked it up when she fucked off. Right, now if we have a quick look at this letter. Um, Bewley. We're in Bewley. I don't know if that's a real place or not. But we're on, upon the moors of Bewley. And we're going to... Well, as the game title suggests, Hobbs Barrow. A barrow being a weird mound in the ground. Or over the ground. Like the Teletubby house, but instead of it being full of dickheads, it's full of dead folks and artifacts. Right, let's try this. The key fits. Another one of these peculiar stones. I was expecting the third one Wait, to be a moon. Does this mean shoulder was the third man on my father's excavation. Could well have been. I, this There's whole time I thought it was the live. drunk dude. Just explain why he's always pissed. My heart is his heart. My light is his light. Good to know. That is that it? Is that the note? The whole note? Can we do anything? No, we can't. Well, that was great. I'm going to continue not fast travelling. Just in case, like I said. And I'm assuming we have to go over and... Uh, get to Orb's Barrow now. Which is this way, I think. Yeah. Let's go and have a little mooch over here, just in case there's anything. Now, at one point, I tried to milk this goat, which is not here. It's probably being sacrificed as well. There was a goat here. I tried to milk it, and then... I had a horrible vision of a dude hanging... Fuck me, the rope's still there. I never clocked that. Anyway, there was a dude hanging and the goat's eyes were all glowing and shit. It was horrific. So, you know, tons of fun. Cut scening. Anything relevant with this stone again yet, or nah? Nope, still nah. I just accidentally clicked it again. She did. Good morning, men. Thank you for braving the weather. Aye, ah, miss. Little rain is no bother. So, may we start? Yes, we've not a moment to waste. And so, the excavation of Hobbs Barrow began. Yeah, just a spoopy hanging, you know, as you do. Horace and his men learnt quickly and went about their work with care. We toiled for hours, rolling away great stones, removing mortar and masonry put in place by Father, Mr. Bryden and Mr. Shoulder. They had gone to great lengths to seal the barrow. I should have realised their efforts were not only to keep us out, but also to keep something contained within. She was having nightmares every night since she got here about this fucking place and the weird little goblin fella, so she shouldn't be surprised. And especially in the dreams where it said, this is not a dream. Eventually, our careful application of pick, trowel and shovel gave way to open space. 
A stagnant, cadaverous odor was let forth. The smell of rotten death. I dread to think what we're gonna fucking find in here. Be that goblin fella. But yeah, I've got no idea how much game is left. I'm assuming this is like the end. But it was like the seal was broken. R four or something. By the time we stopped, and I thought, you know what, R four is late enough. I couldn't believe my eyes. Splendid work, all of you. Step inside, miss. We'll be right behind you. Thank you, Horace. I can't wait a moment longer. Oh, this is bad juju, mate. Now, I'm hoping, because the, the past couple of days have ended up that being long and full of puzzles, I hope day three isn't proper this. short. How could they possibly grow here? I don't know. That's the trouble. Horace, the Barrow Queen has breached the barrier, Chivy. I don't know what's going to be next. I had a look around for spoopy point and clicks earlier and I couldn't really see anything that gained any real interest for me. I'm thinking, seeing as I fixed it, if we finish this I'm, I still feel like streaming. I'll just play some more Sonic Origins, which is a bit different, I grant you, but it is what it is. Fairly standard Bronze Age pottery. Smashed to high heaven, I'm afraid. I'm not going to take not it with us. making a note of. Fair enough. I'm just going to check again anyway. Fairly stacked. Smash. Not worth. You see, right click is look at and left click is pick up essentially. So I did the, the look at first and then the pick up and sometimes she just does the same thing twice, which is, you know, shit. A burial urn perhaps, though there's no sign of ashes. <sighs> Plowing my way through this time. fucking non-alcoholic beer. To the point, I might even have another one directly after. Tend to have them quite sparingly. A burial urn, perhaps. An unremark. Yeah, just the flowers. They look the same as the flowers that were stuffed down Mr. Ambrose's throat. Strange. Oh yeah, there was a, there was a Wicker Man sort of moment. <laughs> Try as I might, these flowers are steadfastly rooted. I bet there's a body under there. <clears throat> okay. What a waste of time. I'm assuming we're not going to be allowed to leave. Oh no, Chats. they've all fucked off. I've been abandoned. Well, that was that was shit. All right, seal it up, lads. Or go back in, you know. She could have said, "Well, that was fucking waste of time." And, uh, fucks off. Why, why are we still in here? Am I supposed to, do I do something with this no, shit? That won't do I have any, do I have, I've got knife. Let's see if I can cut them away. There we go, that'll do it. Incredible. Is it? Something has been boarded up here. Oh. Move the rocks, I guess. Hilarious. The rock appears to be holding. I shouldn't have skipped that dialogue. It's nice to have all the dialogue. Iron stakes have been driven through the boards, holding them firmly in place. I feel <laughs> uneasy about what might lie beneath, but what choice do I have? Two sacks. Sozzle. Where are my headphones? Oh, they're there. Uh, right, as we were. Iron stake. I can't remove the stakes with my bare hands. Right, praying tool. Chisel? Hmm. I can't seem to budge the stakes with this. Okay. Knife. Curses. I can't get enough leverage with this knife. It's too thin. Okay. The trowel, then. That did it. 
good old trowel's been dead useful. A passage. Father, I'm coming. Her dad's in a hospital. He had an accident. Mother said that he fell off his horse. He didn't. Something happened here. He's paraplegic now and can't talk. Weird Goblin Boy said that he would be a good. Weird Goblin Boy said he'd be able to help him. He Am helped I him get out uh, previously, 25 years ago, and he can help him again now. Thank but goodness. Don't know. Fucking hell. Just goes on and on, this shit, doesn't it? Spoopy. Is that... Looks like... A big neck of a lizard. There's its head. Sleepy lizard. Godzilla, maybe. Or dragon. Probably just rocks, though. Oh, here we go again. Ready for some sort of horrific creature to appear now. My went out. For good this time. Maybe not. I had no choice but to venture forth into the darkness. With each step, the passage narrowed in every conceivable way, until I was on hand and knee, crawling through thick clumps of vegetation. The odour of that dank soil was somehow unnatural. I crawled for an age, until I emerged in a cavern that seemed lit by the very earth itself. Well, that seems unlikely, doesn't it? Okay, what we got? Panel, panel, door. Okay. A great stone slab of a door. Do you reckon we have to put those stones a thin in here? strip of stone. It's a slightly different colour to the rest of the masonry. A thin... What is this place? It's as solid as it looks. I wonder if there might be a death thing. Should we do a quick save? Potential death door. This stone panel seems somewhat loose. Depress it then. This stone... This stone panel feels firmly affixed. Chisel. Perhaps I can chip away at the edge of the stonework here. It'll be fine. It, yes, well, it will. Well, the chisel broke, but what have we here? Ah, perfect. Mm. Three niches have been carved into the stone. The question is, which order did it go in? Oh, uh, the note. Does the note give me clue? It only said two things, but... Heart is his heart, my, my light is his light. Alright, well that's not particularly helpful, is it? Let's just chuck them in anywhere. The order we got them in. Good. This stone panel... Nope. Right. Try a different order. I mean, there can't be that many orders, right? Perfect. <laughs> Blip. Oh, Incredible. fuck. Right, I've got an idea. Have a look at the raving lunacy that me... Put it down! Me dad wrote. This is the shit I'm interested in. P and E is all I've got there. This probably the nonsensical puzzle. There is no E. Hmm, a clicking sound, but nothing happened. Okay, let's find a relevant word. Epsilon. 
rho theta epsilon. Or theta epsilon. Wait, rho epsilon. Rho epsilon. Let me try that. I can't do either of those. Huh. Theta? It's not in things. We can try theta, maybe. Okay. Okay. I've got no fucking idea what's going on here. Oh, God. There must be something somewhere. There has to be a clue. We didn't. We didn't use Google at all last time. I, I'm not fucking falling into it now. We just need to work this shit out. We found the code was simply in the singularity of the characters. All eyes must face toward the seventh Ar Archontic. I'm assuming that's what it means for this puzzle here. I mean, I don't understand what it means, though. When the Son of the Two means me, the Guardian shall be defeated. Stars. Moon stars, listen, mouth. There is no center, though. Bap. Babs. I'm into babs. Show me some babs. <laughs> Oh, there's no having them back. Ah, oh, shit! This this X got something to do with it. Is it is it possibly the shape? We could do the shape. That makes sense, right? I mean, it doesn't particularly curve, but we could do that. Maybe. There's a P. Oh, there aren't enough. Hmm, a clicking sound, but nothing happened. There aren't enough to fucking do that. Unless we do it like that. Is this the starting point? This could be the starting point and that could be the finishing point, maybe. Wait, XI. 11? Does, does that mean anything? Oh, shit. Hmm. A clicking sound. But nothing happened. So I'm meant to go all the way back again. Like, hit that as well. Hmm, a clicking sound, but nothing happened. I'm at a loss. I could do with a hint. 
I don't want to use Google. I really fucking don't. I just, I've got no idea what I'm doing. There's an I, there's no X. There aren't the letters to write anything. I need, I need more information. What about if we fiddle it? I should take a closer look. I'm not sure. The fiddle and bow, left to me by the young girl at the devil's toe. I should take a... Hmm. Oh, put the fucking fiddle away, will you? I'm not sure what... I am fucking baffled. Anyone got any ideas? I can't. There's a P and an O. There's no H. Oh, I didn't want a P anyway. That's the P. We found the code was simply in the singularity of the characters. All eyes must face towards the seventh archon archontic. I don't know what that means. What's an, arch what's an archontic for a star? I'm going to have to Google that. I might fucking be able to work some shit out. Contics or Arconticani were a Gnostic sect that existed in Palestine, Syria, and Armenia, who arose toward the mid 4th century CE. They were thus called the Greek word, yep, principalities or rulers by reason that they held the world, the world to have been created and ruled by malevolent archons. Some interesting imagery here. Look at this motherfucker. Do you reckon, do you reckon this is who we're trying to summon? This happy looking fella. Now, seventh Archon, Archonic. Sabalth. Can we write Sabalth? No. We don't have a T, we don't have an H, we don't have an S. In fact, the only thing we've got is the A and the B. Oh, and an O. A, B, A, O. That's, that's the best I can do. There's no R, so I can't write R. Can't. I can't write uh, Gnosticism. We can write Io, which is the first one. We can't write Sackless. We can't write Seth. David, we can't do that. Is there an E? No, we can't do Eloian or Elilarios or Yaldabaoth. It's not going to do anything, is it? I'm going to have to fucking Google this, aren't I? Ugh, 
that is very annoying. I was warned there was a puzzle that had no rational fucking explanation. And suddenly it's gone from me. Right. Oh, God, I'm so fucking annoyed I'm having to do this. Is there a V? No, there isn't. I just had a thought, but nope. <laughs> Oh, apparently fast travel was disabled anyway, so we couldn't have run. Uh, right. Where are you supposed to get this information from? I can see the solution now, but I can't see any justification for it. Right. I'm going to find the reasoning. I don't wait. Fuck you, it was here all along. Alright, well at least we've got the reasoning now. Did I miss one? I must have missed one. I did. No, I didn't. What? I A W A B Ah, I did. Packers. I was right about that being the first and that being the last though. That's something, yeah. Here we go. Shit is oh, kicking off. The light. Very annoyed I had to look at a walkthrough. I was, I was so sure it was going to be in that book. If I, and I looked at those tablets again as well. I've, the whole time yesterday, whenever we got those tablets, I was, fucking, was very well aware there were letters Curses. on them. Absolutely Goodness dicked me. myself out of fucking solving that one. There's nothing Bronze Age about this. Roman? Ancient Greek? No. This is something else. Jivvy. Cheers. Right. What have we got? Fucking lots. The figure is presenting what looks like a sheaf of wheat. A simple pot made of clay. It's small enough to carry with me. <sighs> Probably do that. This one has shattered to pieces. Mm. These are all empty. Mm. Mm. The tiles are broken here. Exposing the soil beneath. The soil feels as hard as rock, despite this damp environment. Two sacks. As we were. The soil feels as hard as rock, despite this damp environment. Not necessarily planting anything here, then. A beautifully ornate pot. This is the only one with a lid. We'll save that one for a minute. There's a small hole in the front of the box. A lock, perhaps. Try as I might, it will not open. There's a small hole in the front of the box. A lock, perhaps. There's nothing inside these. The figure is holding a whip. I'm deep within the burrow. There is a nook hidden within the fist, as if to hold something. 
Right, what's what's this one holding? The figure is holding a whip. a whip. Right, so that needs to hold a whip and that one needs to hold wheat, clearly. <sighs> Curses. The way forward. Right. One of them's gonna be in that, one of them's gonna be in that. I theorize. Sealed tight. There's something rattling round inside. Maybe the key. Take the knife to it. The seal is too tight. I can't get the knife in anywhere. Hmm. I mean, that's not going to work, Some situations do call for brute force. We're going to smash it. Key? There's something here, made of wood. Crank? It looks like a crank handle. Okay, maybe that goes in the box. It looks like a crank handle. You said. It fits in the hole. Let's see if I can turn it. Ye olde ancient time jack in the box. My nope. word. The box is full of seeds. We are planting they something. Glow in a most unnatural manner. Are they the seeds that those weird flowers are coming from, perchance? Hmm. The soil is too compact. I can't plant the seeds in soil like this. Well, you're gonna have to fucking start, love. Trolley up, homie. Bash that fucking soil. I've broken up the soil. It's loose now. Good. Now plant the fucking seeds. There we are. <sighs> Super. I've planted the strange seeds. I've planted... Anything in this? A simple pot made of clay. Well, we're going to need water, aren't we? I don't need to take more. I mean, you'd assume we'd need water. We do anything with this? No movement there. No movement there. Fiddle? I'm not sure what that would achieve. Nor am I, but... No. That's a pic... No. That's a pic... Doesn't look good for her, does it? I need to find a way out of here. Right, what am I missing? Water! I'm missing that water there. I could hear it this whole time as well. It didn't even occur to me. Muppet. It occurs to me. I collected some water in the pot. Look, check this out. Uh Lo, a place of miracles, a plant seed sprouted before our eyes and illuminated our path. Nature's laws hold no meaning here, but I clutch my tablet with the knowledge that it shall end this. See? Look, we're on this shit. So this should just work, because who needs the sun, right? Perfect. Wheat. Oh. Uh oh. I. Am I dreaming? No, it's not exactly what I was expecting, but. The wheat is firmly rooted. I can't pull it out. It's really throwing all the puzzles at me now. It fits. Well, of course it fucking fits. Now, my question is, right, roots, use root as whip, yeah? It's going to be those ones, damn it. I've removed a portion of the root, I'll keep it. You will, right up until this point where you put it there. I'm almost on to something there. We need more. Attach it to and stick. The crank? Yep. See, look, look how easily I'm doing this. I'm so pissed off that there was that one puzzle I just couldn't do. It 
fits. Here we go. Oh, do I really want to play Sonic Origins after this? Not really. Oh lord, there's more. I'm unsure if this had any function. It seems bare of any detail. I think we should save. Uh, maze? Looks like it might be a maze. Asherns, perhaps. A thick, greasy substance is oozing from the broken pot. Seems legit. In any other circumstance, this beautiful vessel would be one of my greatest finds yet. Here, it seems meaningless. A thick, greasy... Thick, What's that? Subs I haven't the faintest idea what it is. I don't wish to touch it. Reminds me of uh, Prometheus. Is that fucking goat? It looks like an object could be placed here. You're right, lad. In God's name, I shan't go near it. I'm actually going to go ballistic in a second. No. 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 I can't believe how well preserved these relics look. They must be ancient. It's in remarkable condition. Right, time to get lost. Oh, no, it's not a maze. The man is presenting a small, rounded object. This figure makes my skin crawl somewhat. What exactly is it? It presents a small, rounded object. It's an ancient vessel. The shape of which I haven't seen before. There is a thin slot set into the front of it, not unlike a piggy bank. Can I take it? Hmm. Characters, perhaps Greek in origin. Anna Abba. This looks like bullshit. I can't move it an inch. It's heavier than it. Do you reckon I could use Google Glass to translate that? Set into the front of it. Not Is it Google unlike Glass? I'm gonna fucking look here. Becky Lynch started a live video. Couldn't give a fuck. Uh, Google. Well, it's not in the Google folder, but that doesn't mean it's not here. Lens. That's the one, right? Let's have a look. Get that out of the way. Translate. Nope. <laughs> I mean, it recognised it as Greek, but it's translated it as, well, exactly what that's. Well, no, actually. Abrasax. Wait, Abrasax. That's the name of that goblin fucker. And then there's Abanag and Analva. Interesting. Accurate depiction for something that must be so ancient. The wheel of misfortune. Astonishing. An ancient device. Uh. A thin rod with tiny notches along the shaft. The head is adorned with an Ouroboros. Ouroboros, I know what that means. I know what that is. It it moves a fraction, but appears to be locked in some manner. It appears this section does not move. It moves a fraction, but appears to be locked in some manner. Oh, shite. It moves... It moves... It moves... It moves... It moves... It moves... I can't fit my finger. Oh, wait. 
The rod doesn't seem to fit here. Ah. Oh. The rod doesn't seem to fit here. The rod does. The rod doesn't. Huh. But it does fit there. That's weird. Anything else? Nope. Goodness me. This is a fucking cat. H Herbert. I knew it's that Herbert. cat was fucking dodgy. What madness is this? Tripping girl. What on earth are you doing down here, you silly cat? Did you follow me? It looks absolutely starving. Extraordinary. An ancient monument so deep beneath the earth. I know not the world I find myself in. Nah, a bit weird. There is a queer heat emanating from the stone. Sauce. The statue echoes the mural back. Wait, what? Something is catching what little light there is in this chamber. The statue bears no moving parts or secrets, it would seem. Now, what were you saying wait, a second ago? Wait, something wait. is hanging here. Yes, what is it? Hmm, a writhing mass of serpents carved from stone. On the reverse side Intricate. is a thin notched shaft. Right. Perhaps a key of some nature. Yeah, right. We need to just find loads of these, I guess. The statue bears no moving. P the statue echoes the mural back in the first chamber. Hmm, nothing of note here. That cat is starting to do my tits in, I'll tell you that much. I've already done this. There is a Right, yeah, that's just where we came from. Oh fucking Incredible. hell. The bust of an eagle. It's facing north towards the goat. The bust of an ass. It's facing northwest. Is this representative of the fucking plates in the pub? The bust of a dog. It's facing east towards the bear. Fucking is as well. There's something in its mouth. There's something in its mouth. Get it then. A gold coin. There are no markings on heads nor tails. Okay, but I mean, we can do something with it. A carved bust of a cat. It's facing west. A menacing goat carved from stone. I think this is a bear. It's facing east. A bust of a mighty bull. It is the fucking place. Southeast. That's madness. An ancient crank emerges from a mechanism within the wall. An ain't an ain't an ain't an ain't My god! A severed hand is locked in a death grip on the handle. Who did this belong to? Ghastly. The fingers are icy cold. I've managed to pry it off. Is Should it... I keep it? Yeah, sure. It's impressive that it's not decomposed, frankly. The hand is dry and withered, like beef that has been left to age. Jerky. Nice. I have no idea what I'm doing there, so let's not fuck about with it. Let us put our coin in here. The coin went in. Hmm. I don't think anything happened. I can't move it an inch. It's heavier than it looks. There is a thin slot set into the front of it. In the Not in the a in the bag. twitcher. There's naught to do here, and now I've lost my coin. I've got this though. That doesn't fit there. All right, fits there though, don't it? It fits. Something moved. In another room. Interesting.
Was it was it something here? Oh dear, I do not know. Something went click. Oh, okay. Remarkable. The statue is well out of reach. A shaft of inexplicable light is beaming from the mouth of the serpent. Extraordinary. You'd be googling it by now. Nah. Carved serpent has a As a result of Google earlier because I couldn't work out how to get into this bastard chamber and it was doing my tits in. Was well out of reach. But once I found out the answer, I then went around trying to work out how I was supposed to get that answer and I worked it out. A great carved serpent. I feel like we need more. Whatever was once placed here. I don't have all the pieces of puzzle yet. What in God's name? What in it's th this one's going to piss me right off. Are there answers to this? There must be something. All eyes must face towards the seventh Archon Archontic. That's this puzzle, right? Have them all look at that fucker, I think. Jammed. It won't budge. Fuck's sake. Is that fa is it facing the right West way now? An eagle. It's facing south. No, no, it isn't. Genuinely couldn't tell. I thought that was it. I thought they were his eyes. The bust of an ass. It's facing northwest. Well, that's the wrong fucking direction, isn't it? This crank is jam. Right, we need to, I don't know, oil it up. I can't get it unstuck with this. I can't get it unstuck. Can we use the pot? I can't see how that... What if we put some of the black goo in the pot? This is this is going to solve the puzzle. I've scooped some of the greasy substance into the pot. Lube it up, mate. The greasy substance could act as a lubricant. That's here. what I said. Voila. Puzzle. Yes. Something has emerged from within the bust. A curious object. I'll keep it. What? Well, okay. Love you. Uh, right, I got the thing. A 
thin piece of stone carved into the shape of what appears to be an eye. I reckon that goes in that thing next to the goat. In here. It fits. Damn skippy. The fragment is the fragment is in place. Right. More puzzles, though, clearly. Can I just walk past the goat? Hi, Jess. Same horrific imagery? Yes. I think that's that goblin fella. Saxnarax, or whatever his fucking name was. Mate, this game is fucking excellent. You join us towards the end of it. If you've got six and a half hours, I would heartily recommend watching the first part, which is now available on YouTube. This what I was playing while you were busy watching Fastlane. I had it on that monitor. <sighs> right, we need to... I need, I need more stuff. I think I shall leave it in place. I can't quite fit my finger in... What about if we do this? Any clicks this time? Yeah, there's a click. So what's what's changing? Something must be changing. I can't move it an inch. There is a thin... You can stab it. Fit into the slot. That won't fit. That won't fit. Uh, you associate point and click puzzle games with me now as well. Beautiful. I mean, they've always been my jam. This is this is a J game right here. People like J. Why aren't you playing Skyrim? I'm like, that is not a J game. This is a fucking J game. Has this illuminated anything else? Wait, yes, and hole. I don't know why, but I really don't want to put my hand in there. Right, stick a fucking knife in there then. I can't see it now. There no, it is. That won't achieve put a trowel in it. Hmm. Put the hand in it. I can't see how. That's a peculiar. No, that. There, feed the cat the hand. Oh my god, she's feeding the cat the hand. Oh my god, that worked. Well, I'm not surprised it's being sick, but there's a token for me. The Sims was never a J game. Ghost. Now I've been here a bit longer. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Dude, I'm seeing rumour after rumour of Punk coming back to WWE. What are my thoughts? I think I've also seen the rumours, and it's probably a terrible fucking idea, but sure, go for it. Why not? It's another coin! This might be enough. Possibly. A gold coin. There are no markings on heads nor tails. I am enjoying this game. The coin went in. Something stirred within the plinth. I should take a closer look down there. Right. We are on now. The characters are now protruding out from the plaque. Perhaps I can push them in some manner. Oh, shit. Clues, please. Can we do... Can we do this now? We've done that one. It might be this one, right? Row Epsilon. There is no R. Have I still got that Google Translate, actually? I fucking do. And Row Epsilon is not an option. Theta? No. 
Epsilon on its own. No, Rho, no. Crown Jewel confirmed for November 4th. That's a pay-per-view I won't be watching. If it's true, it'll be his last chance. I don't think it'll fuck it up. I do, because it's CM Punk. It's Phil. Phil specialises in fucking things up. Dead language reveals the path. Moon stars. Listen. Mouth. None of this helps. Okay. We only get four letters. Alright, what have we got that's four letters in weird? Eyes? Can I write eyes? No. Can't write path. I can't write fuck all. XI? I can do an X. That's X, apparently. But there's no I. I've been here so long the music's run out. Fuck's sake. Jesus Christ! Hello, Cully. Oh, the music's back. And Jess is off for a shower. What brings you here? Oh, Culshaw. I haven't seen you in a stream in fucking ages. It's MC Cully, everybody. Bapo. This is confusing. Are there any clues? You got an email notification. An email notification. How bizarre. I think I shall. That shit's not going to do anything until we get whatever that is. Which I'm assuming is in here. I've inserted two coins, which seems to have caused a mechanism to stir within the plinth below. It's an ancient vessel. The there is a thin... I've inserted two coins. I need more information, bruh. A remarkably... A remarkably... That is well out of a hole has been driven into the side of the stone. I'm unsure if this had any function. It seems bare of any. We should probably get a save in, shouldn't we? I spelled plinth wrong because I'm a fucking moron. Hello, Kirsty. Look, MC Cully's in the chat. I've done everything there is to do in this room, haven't I? I can't go any further because the scary goats. I've done this bit. It looks like an op. It looks like. <sighs> Fragment. Oh, it's that. Fragment. Oh, mate. Uh, well, I went into the burrow, I got abandoned by everyone, and then I found, under a load of flowers that I had to cut away, uh, some something that had been boarded up and covered with rocks. So I moved the rocks, and then lifted out a bunch of nails to remove the planks. I went down into a secret tunnel, used my lamp, and then my lamp ran out, and I just burrowed my way through into... Not here. A room 
out there. Then I had to do a puzzle to get in here. <sighs> Two puzzles. Uh, the second of which I couldn't do. I had to go on to a fucking walkthrough. It was very annoying. Uh, but then I worked out the actual solution regardless. And I was like, ah, right, I get it. And now I am here again. Hang on. This route's back. I don't need to take more. Okay. But yes, I, essentially, I am in the barrow. And I'm trying to work out what the fuck I'm meant to do here. I'm meant to press four of these letters to achieve something. But I can't see any clues anywhere as to what the, the fucking four letters are. Because that's three, none of them are there. That's five, none of them are there. That's seven, that's two. Just doesn't make any sense. The word eyes is the only thing that's in red. As far as four letter words go, well that and path. And I can't write either of those. So I really don't know what the hell I'm doing. I'm absolutely fucking baffled. I'm going to have to look it up. I know. I'm annoyed as well. Maybe I'll see a clue first, though. Oh, right. Yeah, I've already done all that. Give me a clue. Just give me a fucking clue. All I want is a clue. The hint of this puzzle is also in the journal. Identify which characters only appear once. Okay, right. That's that's all I need. I don't know why I came out of there. Actually, that doesn't help. I mean, that helps, but where, where are the rest? <coughs> Is it these? There aren't, there aren't any more characters. I'm not surprised, mate. My brain's trying to escape as well. I mean, I have the solution right here in front of me. But I want, I want to understand why. You must identify which characters only appear once. But there's only two. That and that. Unless it means Theta and Xi as well. But... Okay, theta in the Greek alphabet is an O. And yeah, okay, so the answer is in the, the fucking thing. But how are you supposed, without knowing ancient Greek, how are you supposed to know? What's happening with The Undertaker? Probably fuck all. Mate, I don't watch wrestling. You're the only person that watches wrestling. 
I, I, I listen to... I understand what's going on in wrestling because you tell me about it. Why the fuck would The Undertaker go and show up at NXT? It makes no sense. Anyway, the point is... P-O... That thing. E. No, not E. Kind of E. P-O... Kind of E? Oh, and that one. Right, okay, so all we had to do was use Google to solve the Greek alphabet riddle. Why? 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 It makes no fucking sense. Anyway, here's a fragment. This must be important. Yes, just like those keys. And that's the, the rod for the other with side. Tiny notches along the shaft. The head is adorned with a coiled serpent. Yes. Moving on. Over here. I think I should. What just happened? That thing came down here. Why can it why can it do that? Does this one go further than it's supposed to as well or Yeah, it does. It appears this section does not move. Right, how do we solve this fucker? Presumably it's got something to do with this. I mean, there's a marker there. I mentioned that previously. So does that correspond with up there? Or that one? I figure probably that one. But that, is, is that little dot meant to be one? So there, maybe? I can't quite fit my... Cena, Cody, and Paul Heyman all uh, on it too. And the push for NXT is working because you're going to watch it. And then, I don't need to. <laughs> right, yeah? I think I shall... What's she doing? I didn't tell her to do Empty. that. Not intentionally, anyway. Do you want to go here? To do this. It fits. Right, no, not that one. So the question becomes... Oh, shit. Okay, yeah, I was right. Cool. And that's presumably the final piece? Name. Could there be something inside? What's this? The final piece. A piece of stone carved into the shape of a crescent moon. It must be important. Yeah, it must be. But what's more important is uh, saving. All te bits. And going for a 10 101. Ah, no, keeping you in suspense. Hi. Sorry, that took me slightly longer than anticipated because I had to go and make a brew. In the iconic pumpkin mug. Superb. R r r r r remix. Remix? Remix. There we go. 
Right, now, is this goat going to get the fuck out of the way, or what's going to happen? It fits. Good. Oh, it's gone. This is fine. Give it. Right, what have we got? A page, perhaps torn from a book? Yeah, props. Kaja? Saja? I have no idea what it means. I believe this might be the lid of the small tomb. It's where that goblin lads are, innit? Or was. Empty. Empty. It's been smashed to smithereens. What a hideous sight. Right. Oh, God! More poos, ladies. A small round niche has been carved into the side of this slab. The soil has hardened into a thick casing. Better get the trowel out. A goat has been buried here. How gruesome. A horn has broken away from the skull. I'll take it. Good. Right, now stick it in that. Hmm. No, that won't work. Or oh, put it on that. Put it on that, because he's clearly got one, and now he can have two. I should take a closer look. Yeah, all that. This is fine. The horn fits perfectly, as if by design. The eye seems somewhat loose in its socket. No movement there. Try as I might, I cannot pry it open. Easy. I can just wedge the knife under here. Got it. Right, that's the small round offering from that uh, mural we saw earlier. You know what? Probably take that piece of paper, eh? Have a little look, see. What have we here? Don't know. This is my father's handwriting. Spectacular. A page torn from his journal. Right, back in the journal we go. Samuel's hand was ripped clean off by an unseen force. Ah, uh, oh, of course! I forgot. The farmer dude said that his brother lost his fucking hand. Uh, there was so much blood, it remains to be seen if Saxnot was the perpetrator of this shocking act. He's a sturdy lad and he'll live, but he is shaken. I am shaken. Mr. Shoulder, however, seems very keen to push on. The man is positively chipper. He's right, though. We do have a job to do, and by Jove, we will get it done. Hmm. Sus, mate. Saxnot. Oh, did we just put the eyeball in there? Seems to, yeah. Remarkable. Yes, Leonard Shoulder was the other guy. Mate, you should have played catch up. Alright, well. Alright, yeah, key. Is. Was there something locked somewhere? That is well out of my reach. I don't recall there being something This locked. key was found clenched within the jaw of the horned bust. Two fearsome serpents have been painted on the Oh yeah, of course you did. You did. So you, yeah, you know where we're up to. Make out chains we haven't done that much tonight. We've only been at it for an hour and a half. That is well out of my reach. And I've had to BRB about 12 times. I need to find a way forward. It's no use going back. Wait, is that, a, is that a lock? It was a recess. There's a key hidden in here. Cool. Another key. There's a key. I'll take it. Tomb key. A keyhole. Huh. Okay. Um, should we try this one first? The key fits. I figured. 
So presumably that's going to open up a key slot to put the actual two Sounds key like in. Sounds like a mechanism creaked somewhere far above me. Or maybe fucking not. She is no Carter now. Is that blood? Oh my god. There's a keyhole though. It fits. Sounds like a mechanism creaked somewhere far above me. That should be enough though, right? That's two for two. What a horrific racket. Yeah, that's not good. I need to find a way... F that dreadful sound seems to be coming from behind the opening. I can almost make it's out a... It's the cat. Button. A tune of sorts. It is well out of reach. Cards. I have no idea. Cards. I have no. Oh dear. It's not moving an inch. Well, what the fuck is left here? Oh, the lid. We haven't done anything with the lid. It's very heavy. We can't do anything with the lid. Oh, the fiddle! These, these notes don't match the cats. Mid. Mid. Low. High. Is it low, high? No. That's not it. No shit. No, that's not Well, it. the cats aren't really sticking to a particular note, are they? It was the same note twice at the end. Start slow. Come on, go again, cats. Come on, cats. Low. High. That one? It's more notes than that. That's not it. Is it this? No, that's not it. I think, that's, I think that's the last note. No, 
No, that's not it. I'm struggling to understand. I mean, I get it, but I can't hear the notes properly. I need to try and match it. I think that's the first one. No, that's not it. <sighs> Mate. I'm having a fucking nightmare. Tab it. They are doing seven notes, and I'm only allowed five. I'm only hearing three notes, low. I don't think that top note's used. No, that's not it. Taking the fucking piss here, lad. Meanwhile, I'm getting fucking DMs again. In the chat, please. I cannot. I cannot deal with DMs the whole time. Stressing me the. Fuck out with this bullshit. I swear I've done this. To the point, this is literally what I have written down here. Which I'm not going to show you because it's actually got me address on it. It's what I've got written down! Look. It's my tablature. Look, I crossed that one out when I realised it was wrong. There. It's fucking... That's that's the tablature. Fucking bullshit. You've got the notes. That would have been more helpful about, I don't know, a minute ago. It's a whole goddamn cave full of herberts. Yes, hogwash. It's your nightmare. Is this all in my head? There, look, hogwash. Gone. As is your nightmare. The plaque is inscribed with Latin text. Of course it is. My father understood the language well. I'm afraid I don't. It says... It says, use Google, whatever the fuck it was. 
It's not Google Glass. It's Google Lens. Translate, please. Right. Because you are the moon, guide to the stars, and listen to all that I have spoke, the words of my mouth should be shown to me. How the fuck are you meant to... I mean, like, literally, without Google Lens, or, you know, I guess typing all that shit into Google, how are you meant to work this shit out? Right. When the sun and the two moons meet, the guardian shall be defeated. This is the dead language bit, right? Reveals the path. Uh, the moon, the stars, listen, mouth. The, all right, fine. A crescent, an eye. It is rather unsettling. A sun, or star. It's too high up. Right, moon. Good. Oh, even better. What? Hello. Brilliant. Father. Father. And relics rare. The priests their flocks do gull. In casting out the earth, take care. Huzzah! I've found a skull. Oh, good. Ooh, and Paige. This is my father's handwriting. He was very silly with his journal, just leaving it everywhere. My initial suspicions are proven to be true. We are not dealing with a mere folk goblin conjured up in the minds of farmers on which to blame their failures. Sack's not made dwell here, but he is not alone. I think back to all I've studied, all I've learned. Everything points to the possibility of a much more malign influence. Something long forgotten stirs within the bleak place. This bleak place. Something dark, something monstrous longs for attention. I have prepared the tablet. I will put an end to this. I don't have a I tablet. I don't understand. What is this tablet he keeps referring to? Don't know, don't care, but I'm pretty sure stars was next. It's too high up to touch. Moon. An array of stars. The palm of a hand. I think these are clouds. Anyway, yeah, it's stars. Where are we going to go next for a horrible vision? Oh, same place, cool. Three. Two. One. My first dig. You can open your eyes now, Thomasina. Come. Hi. Are you ready for your first excavation? Father. Capital. Make sure you remember everything I've taught you. I have a feeling you might find something special. Well. Can you hear me, Father? Is it really you? I'll be watching the steps, my little suspect. Bird. Good luck. That we won't find an urn this time. We will find something diabolical. Ah, there's my trowel. I remember this. So do I. As we did last time, left to right. Nothing. Nothing. Nothing on that one. Alright. It's all going to go horribly wrong here. Strap in, gang. Oh, the wretched smell. What is it? What is it? Father? Father! <laughs> well, 
Well, it was a dead something, wasn't it? I think it was Listen next, wasn't it? But we'll have a little it's look. too high up. A burning flame. A single ear presents itself. An oak? You know what? I don't need to check my phone for the Google thing. It's all right here. Um, yeah, Listen. And then Mouth. Cool. He is awake. She looks devastated. Ah, right. Now, this seems to be leading towards a picture spoiler I saw on Google earlier today. Mother? Strap in. Nothing pleasant here. Thomasina? Is that you? Father! It is! It's me! My dear, sweet little bird. I'm so very dreadfully hot. Please remove these covers. They suffocate me so. Father, y you can talk again. And I've got so much to ask you. Yeah. So much to tell you. Mm. But please, first, the covers. Mother? 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 Just checking. Here we go. Yep. That's a picture I saw earlier. Delightful. Father, your body. Oh, my dear, clever girl. You're so close now. How good it is to finally speak with you again. But don't worry. It will all be fine soon. You're close to the end, little bird. We are. I think. I think we are very much at end game now. Right, that's where we're going next. But it looks like a rolling sea or river. A crown. It almost looks poised to speak. Right, are we actually at the destination or do we get another horrific vision? Destination! Right, here we go. Game saved, ideally. Chivy, it all ends here. Right, here we go, the final descent. God, this is mad. Anything off to the side? Nah, no, fam. Yes, my god, indeed. Yep, there's a lad. The old chicken-headed fella with the snake legs. Was that the picture we saw earlier? This ends now. It's your soil. Soil? Something here in the soil. That'd be the tablet, I guess. A tablet made of lead. There's an inscription scratched into it. Alige's daemonium incantamentum. With mine blood shall thou be bound to the earth, and only with mine blood shall thou be free. That's why they want my blood. We should have done a manual this is save. What was referring to. My father wrote this? I know what I need to do. Oh, the music's happening. Well, this is it. We're strapped in. I think this I, th I think my interactivity with the game is over. I assumed it was going to give me a choice, which is why I wanted to do a manual save, but nope. So if we carried on playing the other night, it would have been about half six by the time we got to this point. Which would be too late. I didn't get my head down until gone five, as it was. Oh good, this sounds fine. And then I was up before fucking midday. Shite. 
did go for a carberry though. Scarcely believe what I saw and then got Starbucks. And then we had Chinese for tea. Ah, <sighs> okay. How does one even attempt to describe the industry? No, wait, I just remembered the start of the game. The game opens with us going to the hospital where Mandem is, so I'm assuming we still do that. <clears throat> All my efforts to do so have fallen on deaf ears. Merely yes, to the sleep on five. To be mocked, oh, same. Pitied and dismissed as mentally unsound. I dare not commit that unfathomable glimpse to paper, but it was real, Mother. He is real. Not an imaginary terror, but a demon, a god, brought to life. I turned and ran, striving to somehow make my way out of that accursed barrow alive. Inspirited by the hope that my yep. squalid deed had freed father from his plight. But that, that fucking, that door though, the one that we came in to begin with, that's still shut, right? Speechless voices whispered to me in unknown tongues that grew louder with every step. Suddenly, there was light. In an hour. Go to bed. Ah, there's Gobbo. Bro, please, man. In the chat. In the chat. No one is going to get you here. Ever since then, I felt this corruption growing within me. It grew stronger and stronger as he raged against the incantation that bound him beneath the soil. I fought him with all my might, tried hard to bury him in the corners of my mind. Oh, Thomasina, how I tried, but I could deny him no longer. I became an but an instrument. His voice became my own. I deceived you. I'm sorry. I am his now. Soon we'll all be his. Hail the Praxis Rex. Great. Goblin been murked. And I've not had a good time either by the looks of it. The fuck? Well, I say she's done it, Leonard. Your Lordship, I believe she has. My dear Miss Bateman, there is a god about whom you know nothing, because men have forgotten him. We call him by his name, Abraxas. Welcome back, Master. Come, Watch Leonard. them get we fucking killed. Aye, ah, only there shall he be complete. Classic. It's like Indiana Jones in it, you know. Open the fucking Pandora's box and just watch everything fall to shit. Anytime you ever get a situation where someone brings someone back for like, say, I did all this for you, they immediately get murked. Oh, suddenly the seventh day, okay. Who knows what happened to four, five, and six, but ah uh, uh, ha ha! Miss Bateman! As I said. Come back to Ticehurst House. It's been quite some time. I've got to get another coffee in a minute. Terrible weather this evening, is it not? Nurse Blaketon has had enough of me smoking inside. Makes her cough, you see. A bit of rain won't kill me, will it? You, uh, you mustn't be interested in me nattering on. Give my regards to your father. Nurse Blaketon is preparing his supper. Fucking nurse skeletal, you mean? I remember. You look pale, Miss Bateman. Do head inside. You'll catch your death out here. And thusly,
we have come full, full circle. Oh god. Oh my god! There's Skeletor. She's gonna explode as well. Yep. Wait. Am I his vessel? Is that why we weren't talking this whole time? Am I am I the is this, am I God body? She's not saying anything. I did do the look at one. Do the look at one again, but nope. Oh god, I'm going to kill him. Ah, Mr. Kemp. Welcome. My heart is his heart, your lordship. And my light is his light. Wasn't he the pub guy? Today's sermon. You'd best take your seat. You dickhead. My heart is his heart, your lordship. And my light is his light, Mr. Long. You have made an Eden here, your lordship. We are ever so thankful to you. I assure you, Mr. Long, this is only the beginning. Please, join the others inside. My heart is his heart. You're a prick. And my light is his light, dear Leonard. How are you feeling? Fit as a fiddle. <laughs> After you. Some weird shit here. Pricks the lot of them. I couldn't agree more. Several years later. And now I sit in this dismal room. Day after day. Year after year. You in prison for killing your dad? Imprisoned and committed with seemingly little hope of redemption. Committed, right. Cool. You have chosen not to visit me. And I understand that, I do. Indeed, I've had but one visitor, Arthur Tillett. He comes to see me once or twice a year. Well, that's nice of him. A loyal and decent Drunk man bastard. who tried in vain to warn me of the wicked plot concocted by Lord Panswick and Mr. Shoulder. Thankfully, Midland Railway accepted his transfer request. He and his wife were able to leave that damnable village several weeks after my excavation. It feels like an age has passed since that fateful night at Ticehurst House. But finally, you have my full account. I thought I knew my father. As I look back on my childhood memories, I can only conclude that it was his wish to protect me from the true nature of his endeavors. But why didn't you tell me the truth? Especially after what happened to him at Hobbsborough. Why did you allow me to grow up idolizing a man who didn't exist? I did not kill father. It was he that guided my hand. I was in thrall to that most malevolent force. As I suggested earlier. Abraxas. I beg you to understand. He has had his revenge, but I know he will return. Where is he now? What more is he capable of? I only wanted to save my father. Oh, mother, what have I done? Forgive me. Thank you. 
I think we're done here. Yep. Are you being sarcastic? I hope you're not being sarcastic. Oh, the voice acting's been fucking solid as fuck in this. But the credits roll! That was mint. I need a sequel, please. Have uh, the train drunk... The drunk train man... Uh, get him out of the fucking... Or get her out of the fucking asylum. And, and go... Go deal with that shit. Good, not sarcasm. I thought it would be a bit weird if it was. Because it was very, very good. Yeah, that game was mint. But yeah, like I say, sequel please. Get her out of the fucking nut house. Back to that fucking village. And put everything right. Probably resulting with the end, her dying, I guess. Because she can't get her dad back, can she? So, Dave Gilbert is the Wadget Eye uh, dude. Solid bloke, him. Had correspondence with him in the past regarding Blackwell. Oh, but what, what to do now? I don't have another spoopy point and click. I'd like to do another spoint, uh, spointy poop and clap. But I don't have one. I'm open to suggestions for uh, future spoopy point and clicks. But obviously right now... Nothing. And the only thing I can think of is to go back into Sonic Origins. And it just doesn't seem right to do that. Oh, Trev. What, how? You missed the entire game. The entire game. Took us seven and a half hours to do that. Uh, it just says HOM, which is the name of the company that makes it. You've seen this t-shirt before. It's nothing new. Credits continue to roll. Music stops. Ah! I can tell you for a fact that uh, this particular piece of music is 120 beats per minute. I know that because I slowed it to 100 beats per minute and slapped some fat drums on it for the intro to this uh, stream. Uh, no, no, I, I came on when I was going to. Where the fuck were you on uh, Saturday when we played this for literally seven and a half hours? Yeah, but we can't be doing that because that's that's the abridged version of Krusty's name. I told Krusty about this game uh, yesterday. I was like, right, all of this. And he was like, that sounds fucking mint. And I think he's bought it. It was on his wish list earlier, and then I noticed it says uh, one, one friend owns this game, and that was Krusty. Yeah, it's just back, back to the menu. All day. We were here till fucking R4 in the morning, pal. At least me and Kirsty were. Fucking hell, that was that was wild. That that was really really good. That was a really really fucking good game. Hmm. Well, as we always tend to say around these parts, it is a case of live, laugh, win, biscuit. Until I see you again, motherfucking deuces. <laughs>